Here's the most obvious suggestion I could give you and in many ways the most important. Don't stand up with little index cards on which you have written small or a piece of paper on which you put many, many words written very small in your usual handwritten scrawl. Think of notes as being this. Notes are a visual aid, not for your listener, but for you. So follow the rules of visual aids when you're making notes and make them bigger. And of necessity, make them simpler, which will of course make them easier to read. Now maybe your notes can't be written quite this big, but if you are reading notes that are twice as far away as a book that you might be holding, don't your notes have to be at least twice as big if they're lying on the lectern or on a table as you're presenting? So think of your notes as this. Make them a visual aid for you. And trust that nothing is less helpful than notes that are too extensive. There's nothing less helpful than notes that say, good morning, it is a pleasure to be here, my name is. Your brain doesn't need that. What your brain needs is this structure. So here's an even more radical thought about notes, and that is, think about turning your notes sideways. So instead of your notes flowing down the paper as we normally would this way, think of your notes sideways for a couple of reasons. Number one, it allows you to put topic number one, topic number two, topic number three in columns. It forces you to only use trigger words or bullet points to remind you of that structure. It allows you to see the whole structure. And nothing is more glorious as a speaker than to think, oh, I can't remember the middle of that third point and to know exactly where to look on the piece of paper. The other reason to think about horizontal notes is horizontal is how we gesture. Think about it. We don't say, I'd like to go to the party and I'm too busy vertically. I'd like to go to the party, but on the other hand, I'm too busy. We do it horizontally. We think and we gesture on this horizontal shelf as we discussed earlier. If your notes have that same format of being horizontally arranged, then the way your notes are arranged, the way you are gesturing, and ultimately the way you are thinking all work together.